The tooth bleaching, also known as the tooth whitening, is process of lightening the color of human teeth. So this lecture is all about tooth bleaching and in this video I will be discussing types of discoloration, indication and contraindication of bleaching and how bleaching works means its mechanism of action. So patient ask for tooth bleaching because they want their teeth to be free of all the stains or discolorations. There are two types of discoloration, one of which is intrinsic discoloration, which can be defined as the discoloration which is incorporated into the tooth structure. meaning this discoloration is present inside the enamel or dentine and it is not removed by cleaning and polishing. The examples of intrinsic discolorations are amelogenesis, imperfecta, Dentinogenesis, Imperfecta, Enamel, Apoplasia, Tooth Fluorosis, Pulp Necrosis, and Tetracycline. stains. So another type of staining is extrinsic discoloration which is defined as stains which are present outside the tooth substance these are usually present on the tooth surface or in the acquired pellicle And the examples of extrinsic discolorations are tobacco staining, coffee or tea staining, chlorhexidine staining, So both of these extrinsic and intrinsic stainings can be removed with tooth bleaching and the indications for tooth bleaching are when patient is not satisfied with color of the tooth. Bleaching can be done before resin composite restoration. or before porcelain veneers. Before ceramic crowns. And bleaching is also done to increase the aesthetics of the crown. Bleaching is also contraindicated when following conditions are present such as hypersensitive teeth, children with large pulps, tooth bleaching occurs by following mechanism of action. First of all oxidizing agent. reaches 
with enamel and dentine causing chromatic particles of enamel and dentine to decolor so basically in process of bleaching highly pigmented uh, carbon compounds are converted into chains of lighter color and here ends the part one of the bleaching lecture tooth bleaching lecture part one ends here if you guys have any questions regarding this please leave them in the comment section i will be replying them subscribe smart k3 dentistry for more dentistry related videos like these thanks for watching see you in the next video